Quite a day. Severe storms left the entire area with lots to clean up tonight, and we are covering the counties for you, showing you all the damage. In fact, thousands are still without power right now across the Miami Valley from all of that damage. Jackie Sprague is live to begin our team coverage. Well, power was just restored to the homes here on Miramar Street in Kettering, but 13,000 Dayton Power and Light customers are still in the dark tonight. Right now, more than 700 crews are working in the field to restore the power to everyone. I'm 80 years old, and I have never seen anything this, this, this quick and this, what the heck, it's unbelievable. Storms rolled through the Miami Valley this afternoon, taking out trees and knocking down power lines. In Fairborn, many Dayton Power and Light customers are still in the dark. I've been going to my car and uh, charging my iPad and stuff on my, in my battery so it won't go down. So at least tonight I'll watch a movie. And this isn't the first time this neighborhood has experienced power outages. Just about every time we have a storm, there's so many trees around here that fall on the lines and everything. It happens quite a bit. Dayton Power and Light serves parts of 24 counties. At one point today, 45,000 customers were without power. DBNL tells us right now crews are assessing the damage and trying to restore the power. In the meantime, they have a warning for you. We know there's wires down, poles down. Any type of wire that's on the ground, assume it's an electrical wire. Don't assume it's cable TV or telephone. Assume it's electrical. Uh, assume it's live and stay away from it. And customers say there's nothing they can do but hold on, be patient. And DPNL hopes to have power restored to all customers by Friday morning. To report an outage, call 877 4 outage. Reporting live in Kettering, Jackie Sprague, 2 News, working for you.